Osborne. You use this to spot, you guessed it, fi- What the fuck? What is it? Nothing, um, you, uh, you use this to- Oh, fuck me! Good God, language, lady. Out your west-facing window. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? West. Whoa, that's not legal, right? Uh, no. You need to get down no. there right now and stop them. Fire danger is through the fucking roof. Where I is. I found them, Delilah. Found them in the lake. Let me Scanning off my leash down. and I will... Yep. Enjoy dealing with that. Taking your radio. Go stereo. Whoa, hey, put that down. Seriously, Drop it. Expensive. Fucking cool it with the fireworks. Please hey, just put it down. We won't light anymore. I've I put them down. I'm not creepy. <laughs> you probably have a tiny dick. Chelsea, it's my boombox. Here we go. Someone broke in. Hey, what? They just, they wrecked the place. Threw my typewriter out the window. Motherfucker. Was it us? Oh, shit. Um, I'll let the Forest Service know what happened. Hello and welcome back. Today, we are continuing on with Firewatch uh, Part 2. I'm not sure how much longer is left of this game. I don't think it's a particularly long one, so I'm not sure how many episodes there will be in total. We did a brief recap at the beginning, so you're all caught up. So, having said that... Let's go. What do you look like? Why are you asking? Because I'm horribly superficial. So, uh, okay, I don't know what we're doing. I look... I've forgotten how to do this. Oh, like that. This isn't that hard. Shut up. I look like Burt Reynolds. Well, Everybody loves Burt Reynolds. Reynolds all the time. What am I doing? Oh, is that so? Women say that we have a similar must. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh -huh. Hey, you asked. Okay, well, that gives me a good start. Am I gonna go see. outside? In my scope, I can only tell you're a white guy wearing shorts. Stop looking at me through your scope. It's hot. And maybe, by the way, I'm not white. Do I have a... A note from Dave, a note from Ron, a note from Teens, a missing person bulletin. Ah... Uh... It's not very, uh, you know, PC or Find whatever Find boards say. downstairs to patch the oh short. God, you are the whitest man. Not sure oh, how we got to this point, but we're here. For that. And if not shorts, then what do you normally like to wear? Uh, I like to wear tuxedos, tuxedos as, often as, as often as possible. Don't you? Oh, really? You oh, really? Oh, really? I didn't realize Boulder was so chic. Boulder? Of high society. She's doing that, um... Mm. She's doing that voice that I'm looking for a guy in finance with a trust fund. Six five flies. Oh, really? That's what she's doing. No deal, yes. Now tell me about your face. I'm looking at you across the bar. Bring that not. What do I see? Uh, hmm. Oh, hang on. Uh, I have. You'll enjoy my thin mustache and well, long I have scar. A thin mustache. Real. Thin mustache. I got a, a long scar goes down across my eye and down my cheek. And you only wear tuxes. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. Sure do. Are you a freaking Bond villain? <laughs> I uh, I, I get up to some stuff. Yeah. Do I? I you're okay. This very oh no, I can get that from here. I I'm taking this. About your eyes. Wh why? I'm drawing you. I need to know. That's not weird. You're what? Is is that okay? Uh. Don't, don't answer. I'm gonna do it regardless. Fine. Your eyes, tell me. <laughs> um, they are tired. They're very tired they eyes. They tired, I think. Oh, yeah? I mean, yeah, yes, someone know, did break in and I've been out every day, so. You think you're a younger person who just looks tired all the time. <laughs> Speak for yourself, mister. But I guess that's getting old. Well, some people no, I should have said happy. I've ruined the mood okay, of this conversation. Thank you, Henry. You're, You're welcome, Delilah. Absolutely. I don't... I mean, I've put a recap in for you, but I'm not entirely sure where we left this, you know? I got that window all patched up. Yeah. So what should I do now? What's next? What's next? What do you think is next? Well, you've been the one giving me tasks for right? two days straight. 
What's next is you sit in that room until September 1st and call me at the first sign of smoke. Oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Why don't you let me know when you're mentally prepared for that task and uh, I'll give it I'll to you. I'll go sit down then. Does that mean I brought enough stuff? Okay, I think I am ready to tackle my long-term commitment of keeping this national forest safe from total destruction. For several months. I am glad to hear you like really thought this through. I'm fine thought this through. Don't worry. Of course. We've issued you a comfy chair to sit in and everything. Have you? You know, it's not really that comfy. It's wooden and there's no padding. Oh, that one. I yeah. I actually got a splinter in my thigh this morning. I have Aww. news. Well, regardless, take a seat. The forest depends on you. We could play some, uh... Nope, we can't. It doesn't matter. Day nine! That was a skip. Yeah, like, where are we getting all our food from? We didn't hike here. Hello, Henry. With, like, fresh Having bread nice and ham. Afternoon. Especially not for nine days. I don't think either of those things would last for nine days. I might never leave. Well, uh... I called with some bad news. Okay. Two young women, Chelsea Stevens and Lily McLean, were reported missing. They've got parents out in California who haven't heard from them in oh, a week. Oh no, please They were supposed don't. to meet an aunt down in Cody. If they're the girls from last week, then you're probably look, the last person to have seen look, them. Look, right, I didn't do nothing. I didn't do nothing. Uh, I didn't do it. I didn't do anything to them. What okay. about their camp? I didn't. That wasn't me. You know that. Don't get defensive. Don't get accusatory. Look, it's not going to be an issue. Uh, I mean, if if they turn up dead, then maybe. Should I just not say anything and save us the trouble? Uh, no, you should. I, I think it's worth God damn, mentioning it's something. It's hard being a good person. Yeah, I'll uh, I'll, I'll keep it vague. I, I really don't want to talk to the cops. Right. Am Me I? Neither. Which way am I going? All right, Henry. Thanks. Enjoy the sunset. Thank you. Do I need to go anywhere? That is a nice sunset. Oh no, I didn't. I suppose I could have gone for a little walk there. Day fifteen. So there's a murderer out in the forest. Then, missing people. Henry. Henry, wake up. I don't like the tone you're using. It's scary. Oh. Get out of bed and pick up the radio. Hey, hey, I'm coming. If I don't, will the uh, things be fine? Wait, hang on, where's my radio? There. What do you want? Can you see hey, this? You big dumb idiot. <sighs> Stop being so flirty. I've been telling you about my sad wife. Babe, it's late. Babe, it's late. You're a big dumb idiot. Oh, baby, you sound tired. Oh my goodness, it's Julia. Mm, I am. Are you having a nice time? Some weird, weird stuff happened. Uh, I don't know. There's some weird stuff going on. Oh, that's too bad. I, it's weird, like, I knew mm, Julia was Australian, sure but fine. I'm surprised that she's Australian. <sighs> well, I'll let you get back to sleep then. <sighs> okay, Jules. Mm. Delilah seems nice. Not that kind of nice. Mm -hmm. Stop sure. it. Bye, baby. Well, we've gone mental. Probably fine. I'm still part of me that thinks all of this is probably us. That we've we've gone to Lulu. What day did that say? 30, 30 something? Hike north to retrieve. Is it too much of a pain in the ass to bring supplies all the way up to our towers? I'm, I'm glad that well, you've answered that question for me delivered. though, because I oh, was. How's that work? It's the perks stop. of a decade of service. Stop. Stop with You're the rustles. You're out hiking in 90 degree heat, and I get to do crosswords. Isn't life miserably unfair? I do you like a crossword? Anyway, when you find the supply drop, remember it's not just for you, okay? Other lookouts, biologists, a few people get their food there, and I don't want to have to call in for more. Is this the right way? This isn't the right she way. I'm already lost. Stuff, though. Beans, okay. prunes, jerky. Uh... You know, my sister eats six prunes a day. Six. She's, like, really so precise about it. Big. She'd be great at this job if she didn't need wheelbarrows full of marijuana to function. She's just having a decent time. Oh, sorry. Am I meant to be talking to you? 
So, like, two weeks ago, you called me in the middle of the night. Ah, it wasn't you me. Were sleeping, I guess, and I, that wasn't me. All I heard was the name Jules. Oh, somebody the else. I just thought it was so sweet. I wanted to wake you up, but then I thought maybe you were having a nice conversation, and I'd just be spoiling it. You would be spoiling it. I hope you're doing okay. Let me. You know, when it comes evolve to evolve into my evolve. That's not the right word, but just just let me be alone with my delusions. I shouldn't be out here. Yes, you should. No, I just ran away from my problems. Wait. No, you didn't. Did. We really all fuck did. up. Sweet. That doesn't seem uh, right. Oh, look. So, a couple not... months before I took this job, I... <laughs> I was with this guy, Javier. Ugh, he's incredible, caring, sexy as hell. Uh. Stop he was a driller down in Casper. Yes, this is right. We dated for almost five years. I was working with the Wyoming Outdoor Leadership School and... Is there not a way I could walk I faster? Did she it. not say that? I wanted to be an instructor so badly. And I was sure I was going to marry Javier as soon as I could this be is, bothered. This isn't the surprise. Well, so it's also a good excuse to get out of town, drink whiskey in the mountains, cut loose. <sighs> then, um... Javier's brother got killed. Oh, Gillette, okay, right, fair enough. For some reason, I didn't come home. Wow, that was a horrible Javier thing to do. Was fine. He'd go to the funeral, take care of his mom, stuff like that. It'd be easier solo. When he came back, he left me. I'm not surprised. I came out here. I lied and told my sister he fucked our neighbor. What? A so. Yeah. I lied to you. I came out here with a broken heart just like yeah, you. Yeah, but your broken heart was <sighs> kind of I figured you've told very self so inflicted. You. So, you know, there's something about me. We both fucked I up. mean, I tried to do the right thing. Mine was just a very sad circumstance. Yours was completely you. I don't know if I'm meant to be replying to her. I feel like I think it happened last time. If I don't reply quick enough, she's like, all right, see you then. Whatever. Also, can I walk faster? I don't remember. Was this where we saw the creepy man? The creepy man with the torch? I'm kind of thinking that something's going to jump out at me at some point and I'm not going to enjoy that. I don't feel like fear. What is that? What is that? What is that? I was about to say, I don't think fear is meant to be the overarching emotion that you have when you play in this game. Okay, it's a fence. Just the, sh the shape of it there was... I apologise if I'm making this more tense for people than uh, it should be. <laughs> is it this? This? One, oh, two, three, four. Ah, just kidding. Just kidding. Um, my two forks. I could steal other people's stuff. That would be mean of me, though, because if someone stole my stuff. All right. I got everything oh, I, I need out of here. It. Time to chow down. Just yours, right? Who do you think I am? I could have stolen everyone's stuff. You've Ooh. got a front row seat for what might be the biggest fire of the year. Yeah, it's really going. I'm gonna call it in. They'll send in a hotshot crew for some suppression, but I bet we'll be stuck with her for the rest of the summer. And. She doesn't have a name yet. I usually think of something funny or something practical or a little risque when coming up with them. But why don't you do the honors? Okay. Uh, I... The Flapjack? Oh, let's call her Delilah. So... No ideas, huh? I literally... Uh, Delilah's a nice name. <laughs> no, you big dummy. <laughs> I was kidding. Mm, no, you were not. You're sweet, but we can't call it the Delilah Fire. Okay, what then? That wasn't flirting. Mm, how about my middle name, June? The June Fire. Even though it's July. <laughs> I like it. Fair enough. I wonder what... 
It would have been so if I'd said the other two. And, um, you know what my favorite thing to do is? What's that? I love to take a bottle of whatever I have on hand, plunge it deep into the water, and let it chill in there all day. And then, on nights like tonight, when it is so disgustingly hot, I have something nice and cool to drink. I learned that from my sister in Santa Fe. She'd do that with a bottle of tequila near her house and make margaritas the size of your head. You'd like it there. I'm sure I would. Some of these answers are getting a little bit it is. flirty. Are you looking at the fire? Uh, no, I'm not. You should. Let me know when you are. Okay. I'm just trying to make sure that there's nothing <laughs> that I'm missing. Truck Washington. Is that actually we put that there? Flora of the Shoshone? Shoshone? Poster? I don't know. Okay. Okay, I'm looking at it again. I love how they look at night. During the day, it's just smoke, but when the sun is down, you can just get lost. Yep. Yeah. I'm glad you're here. Thank you. Sure you sure are. You are. <laughs> I am. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Right? It doesn't matter. I get it. And with Julia and everything, you probably don't want to be here. I don't know if that's true. <sighs> Forget I said anything. I I just meant I like that you're here. Okay. Just don't we both just go watch this fire and try to imagine all the old dead things it's burning away. What about the alive things it's burning away? I'm just trying to make sure she doesn't get too familiar, okay? I'm not here for that. You're going fishing without a license? Yep. It's one fish, and I'm sick of all the stuff I got to eat. I'm assuming it's this way. I'm no. going to go this way. I won't tell anyone you're a poacher. That reminds me. I keep hearing reports from Fish and Game about a problem bear they're trying to keep tabs on. Can you search around the lake for fresh tracks and just let me know what you find? There was a crew burning fire lines out to the east, and, um, you know, I think sometimes it riles up the what wildlife. What is that? What is that? Uh, does problem actually mean murderer? Like, how Charles Manson is a problem cult leader? Oh, come on. You just have to look for tracks. That's it. I thought I took those fireworks. Uh, can't believe I'm going to leave this planet as a pile of bear shit. Uh. Thank you, Henry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I thought... I thought... I thought I took all this stuff. What? I don't understand. Am I mental? Is Delilah really Julia? Ooh. And this is somehow a future Henry replaying his past with little changes to I don't know, protect his consciousness. I found a clipboard. Oh, can you just let me look, please? What the... Uh, D? I found a clipboard down here, and I, uh... There's something strange going on. At the lake? What's up? Someone has written down what we said to each other, have been saying. That doesn't make any sense. Uh... I don't talk to the other lookouts as much as I talk to you, not in the same way. No way. Wait, hold what on. The Something's out what here. Was the, what, what, what the, what the, what the, what the... Henry! I'm worried. Okay, let me just put this down. No, wait, you didn't no. didn't find and eat any mushrooms, did you? I mean, they can be fun, <sighs> but also, okay. you know, <sighs> devastating. Hey, but... Regardless, just let me know, okay, buckaroo? Oh my goodness, I'm trying oh, to reply God. to you. I don't know why I just called you that. Yeah, I don't know why you called me that either. Um, local, locate, local, locate strange noise towards the canyon. Is that this way? That sounds like a radio, right? What is that? Oh! <gasps> <laughs> Mother of God! 
God, no! Henry, are you there? What happened, <clears throat> Henry? I... Holy hell, I just... I got hit in the head. Punched or something by someone. Are you serious? What the hell is going on out there? I don't know. Jesus Christ. <sighs> Let me get this straight. You found a clipboard with... What? Transcripts of our conversations? What else yes. is on it? I don't know. Oh. It's gone. Along with a radio of theirs. You know, somebody out here could have just killed me, Delilah. I'm gone, I'm gone. <sighs> I don't... Can I get my what fishing rod out? fuck is going on? What's Wapiti Station? I, I... I... I don't know. I saw the name Wapiti Station right before I was cold cocked. Does Wapiti Station mean anything to Whoopity? you? Wapiti? Um... Uh, Wapiti Meadow. Maybe it's Wapiti Meadow. It's it's on our maps. It's not too far from where you are right now. Okay. It's north of the lake. It, it looks like there should be a trail somewhere on the north shore of Jonesy Lake. I'll uh, I'll start hiking that way now. God damn it, my head. Are you are you sure you saw what what you saw, Henry? Maybe you pissed off some more campers and they came back to sucker punch you. This just oh, this just seems like a like a misunderstanding. I think are you involved Look, in this? I know this. what I saw. Hey, it was our words with initials for our names, H and D, clear as day. And you've been feeling Is she trying okay? to convince me I'm I crazy? Because I'm not. Okay. Someone okay, punched I'm me sorry. in the face. I, I, I you, freaked out. That conversation was from two weeks ago. I know they were. So How do you know that? What's How do you that remember that? Two weeks ago. From three, four, or five weeks ago. Our entire relationship, friendship, our, our whole summer. Someone is out here with the walkie-talkie, taking notes and talking to God knows who. Is this because I'm going the wrong I'm way? I'm hiking through the canyon. Which way is my best bet for getting to Wapiti Meadow? It looks like you can find a trail on the north shore of Jonesy Lake towards oh, the west. Oh, Christ, yeah. I've, uh, I've gone way past. My bad. I thought, right, because, listen, listen, I thought I could go, I can't, I can't get the mouse onto it, but... Back a little bit where there's the lighter colour that goes up, right? That way. Can't believe somebody just punched me in the back of the head. You could kill someone doing that. Maybe that was the intention. Here. Okay, yep. Yeah. Okay. okay, well, there's nothing else to say. I was too busy getting lost. What? Hello? A rope hook? Oh, there. I mean, I will. Do I need to go this way now? Oh, I'm I'm going this way now, apparently. Hope you didn't want a nice chilled experience for this game, because you ain't getting it. No one can cold cock me when I'm running so fast. Ooh. Report Whoa, that there's a fence Delilah, here. There's a big chain link fence between me and the meadow. I I don't think I can get past it. Uh, a fence? Yeah. How big? Big. It goes off in both directions. Acres. But what the fuck is going on out here? Whatever it is, someone doesn't want anyone to know about it. Sometimes biologists will cordon off a little area to study flora or whatever, but that's only a few square feet usually. That's not what this is. <sighs> well, see what you can do to get past it. What is that noise? Looks like goddamn Area 51. Why are those rocks like Maybe that? Maybe they've got aliens. That'd be exciting. Okay, yeah, we'll evolution. see about that. Can I? Did that work? Port and gate. And the gate is locked up, obviously. Obviously. I'll see if I can break in somehow. I'd like this other rock. All right. Be careful. Ooh. Nope. Two rocks weren't good enough. Shove. 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 There must be a way. I thought I said shovel before and I was like, yeah, give me the shovel. Okay. Uh, let me go around this side. Stop with your noises. Okay. Look, I'm not going to be able to get into this place. 
I, I don't know how long I can dick around out here until someone notices. Who are you? God, if you were an actual firefighter, you'd have that gate down in two shakes. Thanks. Hey, actually, those guys doing the controlled burn, they might be able to help. Where are they? Beyond Ruby River, there's a scout camp. They burned a line a few days ago that should let you hike right to them. Well, that's great. If they haven't left, they're probably the type of guys who would help you get through that fence. Oh, come on now. Don't be this... Oh, so far away. Okay, well... Oh, god damn. Right, I'm going. Maybe I'll get cold cocked again and it'll put me forward in time. No, nope, she doesn't even want to talk to me. Who just puts up a fence? It did have something on there, like a, a code or something. Can we not ring? I know what we can ring. Be like the actual ranger service, the sheriff's office. There must be people other than us who know things. Goodness. Thank goodness. I'm wandering around oh, east of sorry. the lake. Which way is Ruby River? I like that it's it does tell me there. Corner of your map. Yes, the scout camp I know. where the firefighters were staged should be on your map. It looks like a little triangle with a flat bottom. Yeah, it looks like a tent. Why would it not want me to go this way? Hey, I called around. Things seem normal with everyone Great. else. So it's just me. Has anything strange been happening on your end? No, nothing really. Nothing really or nothing? Nothing. My door was open the other night, but that's not strange. That doesn't sound like nothing. It's nothing, I promise. All right, I'm headed toward the camp anyway. Am I? Keep your radio close to you. Hey, what you just said, keep my radio close to me. Yeah? Before I got attacked back at the lake, I saw a radio on the ground. Kind of like the one I use. And? Do you think that maybe someone was, you know, uh... I don't know. What? Hailing me, following me around, like working with other people? Henry, you are way too much of a dope to be in the mob. Someone is clearly able to hear us sometimes, and was hiding near the lake. Come on. I... I... I just... Just admit it. You're a little worried. Of course I'm worried, but let's just try to keep things calm, okay? Keep things on an even keel. I know we don't know what's going on yet, but I don't have a good feeling. Neither do I. Don't I like feeling vulnerable. We it's couldn't go that way. Police. Wait, has that been? I was thinking about the Goodwins. It just struck me that if anything weird like this happened to them, happened to Brian, just how scared he would have been. Uh, wait. Do so they've? I'm sure he's fine. I'm sure he's fine, Delilah. I mean, don't you think if this started happening to them, he? I'm or assuming his dad the firefighters did this, right? I don't know, Ned. Because last time I was, was here, that guy. I was barrier. No, I couldn't get through. That weird. A catchy. The moment you hear someone in the bushes or get punched from the shadows, you're getting your boss on the phone. Yeah. Ryan is fine. I want to report this bear. I hope so. It, it was three years ago. He's in high school now. Who's Brian? He's on summer break. Yeah, you're right. You're right. I found where they did the controlled burn. I can hike right through here now. Yeah, normally they wouldn't do that so close to a body of water, but I think they're extra worried about a fire jumping the river and burning up to two forks, now that there's someone in it. Well, I'm extra appreciative of that. Let's see. The scout camp is southeast of the river. There should be a pond on the way. Got it.
When FBI informants need protection, you call the police. When those informants wind up dead, you call Neil Black. In a rain-soaked return to South City, Neil Black is a hung out is hung out to dry as the only man who can piece an FBI case back together with danger lurking around every corner. Introducing Black's nemesis, the shadowy Don Carl, three blind mice is sturgeon at his best. Neil Black is stabbed in the back. Who will be the one holding the carving knife? One thing's for sure, it's not the farmer's wife. Okay, it's £2.50 this book. Is this meant to be related to me? Excellent. What happens if a controlled burn gets out of control? Someone gets fired. Nice. And, uh, ugh. God. Ugh. Are you serious? Oh, come on. That one was an honest accident. I'm not even in the mood for wordplay. That's how wound up all this shit has me. So does it want me to go down? Because I really want to go get that cachet. I could try going along the river, I guess. Just waste some time. See if I can get to the cash, the cache. I'm not listening to you. Whatever was rustling out there. Back in. Is it this way? This way? This way? I'm going to say it is because this is the only way that it's allowed me to go. But yeah, I've made progress. Please stop rustling. The graphics look very like raft, rafty. I like it. We should play some raft. What's that? A raft? There's some old snowmobiles out here. That's crazy. Looks like one of the poor bastards was cruising across this pond and dumped it. That was not a fun hike back to civilization. Whoa, someone stripped these snowmobiles down to the bone. Huh. And that's weird, right? I mean, I can come up with a bunch of not weird reasons someone would do that out here, but given what's happened, yeah. Yeah, that's weird. Uh, there's an old pond out here, not much more than a pile of mud. Uh, do, do you have it on your map? Ah, uh, yeah, I know where you are. Yeah? Where am I? Pork Pond. There used to be a sign up for it, but, um, well, folks kept stealing it. Okay, so I need to keep going east. Oh. Ah. Okay, that didn't matter then. Shush. God's sake. The bridge to the camp is out. Damn. I'm gonna walk the ravine and see if I can find some high ground to get across. Good plan. Walk the ravine? Like this walk this way? This where one would walk a ravine? Well, we'll soon find out. Ow. I think I would have gotten strong enough to climb back up some of these drop-offs, but here I am. Oh, totem pole. Yeah, well, we've all got our limits, Henry. Left or right? Uh, either. Go right. Left. Hey. You ever talked to any of the scouts? Well, they haven't been out here in a while, and I generally don't have a lot to say to preteens. Unless it's Brian Goodwin. Well, if forced, I mean, I can make conversation with anyone. Plus, it was sort of fun to hear about all of his nerdy hobbies. Uh, I guess these little shelters are where they keep the weeblos. For the past 35 years, yeah. Sorry to cut that conversation short there, Delilah. There are bear traps out here, in the scout shelters. Scouts Ooh. are stalwart prey. That's messed up. 
How many hikers go missing in the Shoshone? Why? You don't think you're going to end up on a milk carton, do you? I found an old flyer for a missing hiker. It just got me thinking, that's all. Like how you said one day you were talking to the Goodwins, and then the next you weren't. Ned Goodwin didn't get mauled by a bear or stuck in a ravine. He was just a ptsd a-hole who dragged his son out to do a job and realized it was a bad idea. You really didn't like that guy, did you? An axe. I don't know. I honestly, I just had a hard time talking to him. I mean, there are lookouts who seriously won't shut up, who call me about every little thing that pops into their head. And then there are those who just want to be left alone. He was the latter. And I'm the former, aren't I? Well, I didn't want to say anything. Hmm. No, it's fine. I'll just uh, chuck my walkie-talkie into the river. <laughs> oh, come on. And uh, you'll never hear from me again. Finally, peace and quiet. Woohoo! Yeah, these guys are gone. Off now. Found where they were sitting around before getting picked up. Damn. Uh, I found an axe. If one of the crew left it, that thing is actually called a Pulaski. I have an axe. This thing will be a huge help. For both getting through the backcountry and getting through that fence. Hey, Dee, they left something behind. It's uh, like a memo from their boss. Hmm. Huh. Uh, next few days, dropping into the thoroughfare on behalf of Dr. Simmons at Wapiti Station. Wapiti Station? Holy crap. Keep reading. Oh, I just thought I would maybe, you know, stop there, let the mystery percolate. My mother always said I would meet someone who'd give me a taste of my own medicine. They're running a research site out there. Uh, he was worried about wildfires. Someone is writing down our conversations. And now we find out there's a research site out here that, that, that we don't know about? What are they researching? Oh, you know, probably just horned toads. I don't want to freak her out, you know. And... A Wapiti Station clipboard with our conversations on it is just, what, recreation for them? I'm just messing around. Somebody is obviously up to something. Oh, I have an axe for the I'm gate. God, here. I've got to go back for the you gate. There's something real happening oh my god, that's cats. so far away. I think that we should consider that maybe this is all just a coincidence, but my gut says that there is something bad going on. Mine too. Okay. So what's next? Well, I've got an axe, so I can figure out a way to get over the ravine and back towards the site. Sounds good. Check in when you can, and keep an eye out for anyone following you. Okay, well, there definitely isn't a campfire there. Did you say keep an eye out for anyone that's following you? Wait, how is an axe going to help me get back across the ravine? Because I can cut down a tree and walk across it. Yes. I'd be so good in the wilderness. I can't cross here. I can't cross here. Okay. Well, we can't go back up the long drop. I'm going to cut this tree down. I'm so smart. So smart. Push it that way. Imagine if it had, uh, like, gone the wrong way. Are we here? Oh my goodness, I thought he'd fallen. Right, okay, so are we just going back the way we came? Are you there? I, I had a thought. Let's hear it. You heard someone in the bushes. Yeah. Okay, so let's assume we're being tailed. Or you are at least. Where are you right now? Just on my way back, in and out of trees in the middle of nowhere. Do you see anybody? No, definitely not. Alright, so uh, tell me what you think of this. <laughs> Did you just cough? No. Did you just cough? No. Oh, oh fuck. fuck. Um... There isn't any way someone, like, another lookout could be on this line, is there? No. Not without tapping our radios. Get in your tower, shut the door. Don't leave and don't use your radio. I I'll call can't... you. Understand? I will call you. <laughs> I 
Are you kidding me? No, 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 because no. That's so far away. That's so far away. Thoroughfare Tower, this is Two Forks calling you for the, oh, 50th time today. What was in that cache? Cache, cache. The June fire oh. continues to move in a southerly fashion. Damn it. Look at his stupid leg radio. hairs. They're stupid. Hello, sunshine. Sorry, went out for a little bit. What can I do you for? You can let me go back to that goddamn cache. Uh, you can do me for a trip out of here. I don't care if it's on horseback or a helicopter or in a canoe. Just get me out of here. Henry, we have work left to do. Let's chat about what's bothering you and you'll feel better. Are you serious? She's being weird on purpose, Let's isn't she? Talk. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. She's being very strange on purpose. By the way, I was wondering if your flora of the Shoshone info poster was still up inside your tower? Yes, it is. What? It's just protocol that those stay up. You know, info about your tower, the surrounding tree species, etc. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, all right. Just, you know, have a look at it. Make sure it's in ship shape. How is she going to talk to me through code with this poster? Okay, yeah, it's up. Why are you acting like this? Great. Just wonderful. <sighs> see, I knew Do you it. see the tree in the top row, second from the left? T Cottonwood. Sure. It's the, uh... No. You don't need to tell me. Just, um, internalize it. It's, it's a great tree. And there's an area called, um, that tree's name in your sector that maybe you should take a midday hike to. Maybe. Delilah got some brains. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. Um, maybe I should go for a hike. Nothing like an afternoon in the Rockies, I tell ya. Radio me the moment you get there. Putting that on. Let's go. Whoa, the June fire isn't going anywhere, huh? No. No, that's why those guys came out to burn that line. It's at the stage where all we can do is pay attention to it. They're not going to try to put it out? Not yet, apparently. Oh, dear. Where am I going? Oh, the what was that? The place, the from the the map, the poster. So, Cottonwood, there, right? There was nowhere else with Cottonwood. On it. No. Have we been up there yet? There's no caches up there though. There's the one there that I haven't got yet, and then. The one down there, which I did get. I did get, but it didn't let me get because it's stupid. It's the worst. Okay, so I'm just, I need to go south, east, southwest, and then south. Meow. But you'd get real fit doing this, though. Oh, I did not mean to zoom in there. I kind of forgot. Did I ever know that I could do that? <gasps> That's useful to know. Every time I see a cache now. We've we've got this one, right? Wait, how did I get here? Just kidding. I'm just kidding. What is this? Read. Ron, really wish the powers that be could issue us radios that didn't suck ass. Most of the time, I prefer to keep things pen to paper, but every once in a while, it would be nice to get hold of you right away. My sister keeps leaving me messages at the main office, but I don't think she gets that I took the job so I wouldn't have to deal with her or mom. I've been sitting at the spot for a while now, thinking about what to say to her, but instead, I'm a quarter way through a bottle of Fife's instead. Miss you, Dave. Is that not kind of what Delilah keeps uh, saying that she does? Hey, who are these guys, Ron and Dave? They're leaving notes for each other in the boxes. Is there any chance that they had anything to do with those girls disappearing? No, they're both rangers. They're not out here this season. 
I didn't really know him that well, but I always assumed the only thing Ron cared about was chasing tail and getting loaded. It's somehow comforting to know that he was able to keep up a correspondence with someone who wasn't going to send him a topless Polaroid. Michael Keaton with Kurt Russell. Amazing. What about this? Is this another Neil Black book? Hmm. November 21st, 1963. John Russell knows the president's life hangs in the balance, but who would believe him? Not just another James Bond. I was thinking that, that it looks very James Bondy. It's that one. Oh, they've got Jane Eyre. Nice. I remember reading that as a kid and being scarred. Yep, I'll take this. Can I not take it? I'm sorry, I shouldn't do that. I shouldn't litter. Another Richard Sturgeon book. First book in Crime by the Numbers from the author of the best-selling Spectrum. One Chance to Die is the book that started it all. Neil Black is South City's most effective but least known detective, a former SCPD officer. Neil is somewhat something to few and ally to only one friend to few maybe and ally to only one justice city is in trouble a city deep in debt tom bulls into turmoil when the deputy mayor is assassinated and south city pd fears the killer is one of their own then the internal affairs investigation ah to put another target on someone's back upon the only person call upon the only person who can do the job neil black in a high stakes game of chicken he is the only one willing to take the risks to stop the killer in his tracks and do what nobody else can put south city in the black excellent well i'm glad we got that cache wait what did that say lending library nice okay uh how far away are we oh cool so i, I can just come straight south mint it's not helpful when they're talking about important things and i'm like looking at stuff i need there to be nothing to focus on whilst they're talking else i won't pay attention no because you don't know we we did a code that you don't know about you don't know where i'm going this way you can't know we did a code. This? Okay. Ooh. The big tree. But the, is this not the big tree? Because I'm a little... I'm at you stupid big tree. Is the rustling just going to stay there forever? I thought I saw something. I didn't. It's fine. What is that? I've got. I've done three. Oh. Uh, I'm here at Cottonwood Creek. I've had that one, haven't you I? See the cash box there? Uh, must be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Somewhere. I've done that one, haven't I? It is. Find it and open it. I changed the code. It's five six seven eight. Are you kidding me? I was in a rush. Why would you say that over the? If you think people are listening, where well, you have to be so cryptic. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Nice. I've got it now. Good. I spent all day getting you that radio. I hiked to a cash box, lied to a ranger, lied to another ranger, and hopefully you are now holding a clean, untapped radio. Hopefully. Holy fuck, Henry. We have to get into that site. Okay. Whatever these people are doing is illegal, right? Are you okay? I don't know, Henry. People have been listening to us all summer. How is this actually happening? Why have they been? I don't well? know. I, I can I, use the axe. I'm scared. Are there any other lookouts this is happening to? Someone else in on this? Anyone? <sighs> this is just happening to us. Everyone else is fine. Well, there must be a reason. Are you sure? 
I've tried to bring it up to Chimney Rock, Elk's Fork, and Beartooth Lookout, and every one of them got confused. Asked me if I'm okay and if I need to be relieved. Okay, so how do we the get fucking back state to... coordinator asked if I was just having lady troubles. So no, this isn't so happening to anyone else, and I'm done asking. And then across. Who is doing this? I don't know who could be doing this. <sighs> Henry, lady. I've been at this job off and on for 13 years. Sometimes here, sometimes over near Jackson, a couple times down in Wind River, and nothing like this has ever happened before. Am I just making all of this up? I mean, the eavesdropping, the spying, is this... Fuck, are you... Are you is any of this real? What? Are you serious? Maybe. Maybe I'm, I'm just... Maybe I'm just losing my mind. What? Like Julia. And maybe it's happening to me, and, and I'm imagining that I have a boss out here and that we're being spied on. Henry... Maybe there was something in the water, or our condo was underneath some power lines, and and you, Delilah, you're not real. Henry, Henry, think about her. If what happened to her were happening to you, you wouldn't even be able to realize it. Okay. Henry, sweetie, I am real, and this is there happening. Are... I'm as real as the sky is blue. Take a second, and then call me back. I'm on your side. Okay. Let me just check my map. I'm going up to that place. So, east. That way. Hey. Uh, I just thought of something not, um, not great. What is it? I filed a report that said that neither of us ever talked to or saw those girls. Why? I told you went missing a few weeks back what the fuck was that what why would you do that i told you to say the minimum and just keep it vague are they doing something I with know. the animals out here and i didn't i i, I just didn't want to so be i need to hassled. call her back and report the strange noise and, and do this conversation probably has a transcript of that entire conversation and i've filed a report that's a blatant lie come on Come on, oh, Delilah. And those girls are still missing. They're being taken by these people who yep. are doing testing? Trying to scare us away? Oh. Fuck, Delilah. Fuck, indeed. We really need to get to okay, the bottom of this. Okay, let me report this strange noise. No. No. Come on, man. Oh, I need to call up. I can't do either. Well, maybe that noise wasn't important. fine it's just silence I don't feel i don't feel like they're as afraid as they should be being alone in the woods you know we should keep checking these boxes eat tasty am i still going the right way she said north of the lake right so I believe I can get there if I keep going east, right? I could get to Jonesy Lake that way. Yeah. This way. This way. Can't believe someone punched me in the back of the head. So rude. So Beartooth and the fire look out. Is that way? Oh wait, no. Oh, I've gone completely the wrong way. So I need to go south. West. Oh my god, I keep saying east and I mean west. Um we'll be there soon. Um Hang on, wait. I never went that way last time, did I? Uh, no, I must have done because I'm pretty sure I've got that cache. I'm going to go down and have a look though because there's no extra markings on my map, which I would assume I would have gotten if I'd have gotten the cache. 
I don't have the cachet. Amazing. Copy the information. There's just the one, right? Up at the top. Right. Read. Ron. Got some bad news at home, so hopefully they'll let me out of here for a while. Who's to say, though, budgets being what they are? Did you get my note about what went down in Wapiti? Sheriff isn't too pleased with me, but I don't know. I probably overdid it. Wish you would have been there. I guess you must have got hung up. Dave, P.S. Amigos is Spanish and Professionales is Italian. Oh, keep it. Oh. What is this book? Um, it's the same author, though. The Fourth Estate, Richard Search. <laughs> Neil Black. Thought a trip to California would do him good. He'd soak up some sun, drive a convertible, and maybe even enjoy a poolside drink with a tiny umbrella. But in Richard Sturgeon's fourth entry in the Neil Black series, California is nothing but a dream. An emergency landing after a murder in first class. Uh, a trans-American thriller that puts Neil the South City streets and slams him into a sordid web of politics. And something... Finance. And all he finds is murder, deceit and betrayal. The new territory for Sturgeon... And it's not to be missed. So, so it was a dream. It was a dream. It was a dream. That's what I'm getting there. That it was a dream. So what's it done around here then? Okay. So there's nothing up there. Cool. Oh. Okay, I have an axe. Come at me now. Try and prevent me. I'm busting the gate down. There's nobody around and it's the quickest way in. Copy that. Let's go, Delilah, me and you. Oh wait, there was another thing there. I smashed open the gate. Should I try to fix or hide this? No, screw it. Okay, okay then. Did I just get stung there? You're trying to reach Dr. Simmons. He is on site from August 15th to October 15th. University owned equipment is the responsibility of Dr. Johnson. Government owned equipment is under the purview of Cat Ferdinand. Remember, this is a controlled area. And any issues, malfunctions, or violations should be reported immediately. I did get stung by a bee, and I feel like somehow that's going to be a problem. I got stung by a bee. Okay. Am I allergic to this, bees? Is that it? Yeah. Did it did it hurt? <laughs> yes, kind of. What if it's a special bee if they've been okay, doing animal I'm, testing? I'm sorry. You heard that weird noise before? Mm, no, I don't believe there's a way to go that way. Oh, did we need to be doing this at night time? The night time is when all the scariest things happen. Okay. Okay. Doing a good job. We are Neil Black investigating. Okay, I'm at the site. I don't see anybody around. Lucky for us. Yeah, lucky for us. D, there is some serious comms equipment out here, wireless stuff. What do you mean? I'm talking a big 20 foot tall transmission tower. We they can probably open. listen to whoever the hell they want. They're nestled down in this valley, which makes it impossible for you or any lookout to see them. And I can't do anything about any of this. Okay. Um, we should have smashed it up. Like, it doesn't necessarily have to be nefarious, right? Because it could just be some sort of, you know, government science stuff. But the fact that loads of people have gone missing and the fact that power lines are cut and someone's broken into my little house says to me that it definitely is Probably nefarious. something with the soil out here too. It's all gridded off. Uh, who knows what else they're up to? And there's all sorts of contraptions and shit out here. Like what? 
dishes and stuff on metal legs. There are wires all over the place. I don't know. I'm not really up on high tech. Uh, wait, wait, wait. What? Oh, I was. Uh, okay, well, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter, Delilah. Okay, okay, here we go. What's the little red light? I'm in their main tent. What's it like? It's definitely some sort of monitoring station. I think I found the thing they used to track us. Holy shit! You know, you swear, like, a lot. Not the time, Hank. Anyway, it's called a wave receiver. Looks like it picks up anything that emits a signal. It's got basic orienteering capabilities, everything. Holy... Holy shit, Okay, Henry. it's only signal green light. Yeah, holy shit. Just target straight take ahead. It, right? Yeah, of course. Distance light strength on signal, turning equals source of signal discovered. Angle distance. Uh, okay, this thing is losing its mind, beeping like crazy. I can hear it. What, what's it after? I don't know. I'm gonna go find out. Hey, okay, let me just record all of this I stuff. I wonder where they are. All, all of their stuff is here. Figure out what that thing does and then I get the I hell will. out. I will. I just... Do you know what I mean? Presumably, okay. when so it's doing the more three. beeps, They've it's... They've got a row of cots here. I want to know what that thing finds. Look, you should get out before they come back. I found their main monitoring desk. You should get out before they come back. Leave me alone. Yeah, I, I think this thing is responding to something in this pile of crap on the desk. Dig through it. What is that? Oh my god, what is this? Are you shitting me? What? What is it? There's a folder of reports here. What do they say? Their assessments about the two of us. There's stuff in here about Julia. Like what? Stuff I didn't tell you. This is... What, what does it say about me? You said there was one about me. And it looks like they've been following me around. What I do when I'm out hiking? Jesus. Henry, do you hear me? It says that you, you and your boyfriend are still together. What? We're not. They're messing with us. Yeah. Okay. They are. How do they even know who he is? How the hell does this... I'm so sick of letting these people do this to us. We should just burn the place down. Think about it. Look, maybe that's what they want us to do. What do you mean? M maybe they're trying to push us to the point where we do something crazy. I mean, the grass is dry as hell here. It... Comprehensive Explorer keeps the path prone to anger. Passive, guilty, forthright. Is this the things that I've made him, though? Subject is fully engaged supervisor, trust yet to be scientifically proven, all signs point towards full cooperation. Subject may be aware of tests, suggests we disengage if subject decides to leave his post. Susceptibility to manipulation 9, supervisor sign off, e.g. We go up in a second. Well, now I'm thinking, what if you're right? I, I just don't think we should do anything that we can't undo. I mean... Well, Maybe it's know. not the best idea. I think we should set yeah, it on fire. Definitely not the best idea. Ah, oh, so fucking wound up. It's all right. I'm just gonna hike back. We have the wave receiver, and tomorrow we can figure out what to do. I don't think we should wait. I don't think we should wait. Uh, okay. Well, I'm gonna get clocked in the head again, obviously. I just want to actually, I just want to check behind the tent just in case there's any sneaky secrets. I know they were like, head back now. But, you know, I'm probably going to get caught anyway, regardless of if I hang around or not. So, you know, there's no free will for this character. What's going to happen to him happens to him. Doesn't matter if I hang around. Okay. Go, go, Henry, go. Oh, we still got the axe. It would make me feel better. I do like a weapon. If you've been around for a while, you'd know that I like a weapon. Whoa. Well, her 
they didn't want to uh, get back that way. Uh, Henry? I think there is smoke coming from north of Jonesy Lake. Okay, okay. That is suspiciously close to where you just were. Do you see it? Jesus, okay, yeah, I see it. What the hell happened to you? It's oh, definitely not the best idea. I didn't... It wasn't me. I didn't do that. <sighs> what do we do? Did I? I don't know. I don't know. This is I, I don't above know. my pay I have no idea what to do. We have a fire burning in the woods. The one thing I know how to respond to, and all of this shit has me wondering what the hell to do. And what about who started it? What about them? Uh, the person who started it? You should report yeah. it. You We're should report it. Watching us out Look, here let's just not do anything that's going to get us arrested, us. you know? I, I, I don't know what to do about that. Except get the hell out. Yes, get us the hell out of here. I will. But that is where I'm going to leave it for today. I think there'll only be one more episode left after this because I don't feel like there's a lot left. I feel like we've got to the, the juicy ending. So hope you come back for the next one, which I'm pretty sure will be the last one. Um, and as always, don't forget to leave a comment below letting us know what you would like to see next. Uh, leave us a like and a sub. And I think that's it.